Hello everyone and welcome back to Chemical React. It's me, Fusion Form, and over there, like always, is my co-host Gorilla Fist. How's it going? And today we have Reincarnated as a Slime, episode 38. Alright. So, from last episode, it seems like everyone that's anyone showed up and they're gonna have this meeting right today for uh -huh. this episode. Yeah. Yep. They're well they're gonna continue it because they're already having it. This is true. Yeah, everyone just just kids like, hey, I'm here. I'm gonna be part of these meetings. Try me, stop me, or something. At least they tried. And and as we talked about in the last episode, this episode had a really good start. It wasn't slow at any point, so I'm pretty. Oh yeah, like yeah, yeah. Continue, pretty sorry. excited about it. So, yeah, so the, we gotta. Oh, go ahead. I'm just saying, since it was the first episode, obviously it's gonna be slow paced. They have to give you a refresher and remind everybody that hey, everyone's back and like everyone got a power uh, level upgrade and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. And they were building up to this meeting. And so, what's gonna happen at this meeting? Are we gonna have a dispute? Are they actually just gonna be like, okay, we agree? And also, uh, Rimuru still has to come out as the demon lord, right? Unless you. Oh yeah, he has to announce it to the world that he is in fact going to be. Are you gonna do that? Yeah. You're just gonna scream it out. That's that's a good question. Maybe a newsletter, a strongly worded <laughs> written letter. I am the demon lord. Be with it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. So enough speculation. So before we start, if you do enjoy our content, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Also join our Patreon if you want to support us and get access to our Patreon version to this episode and many more. And without further ado, Fusion, I got my fingers up. Three, two, one, go. Ooh. This music, though, <laughs> so ominous. It's uh, Clayman, isn't it, huh? Yeah. Uh, no. Is it? Oh. No, of course not. I don't think this is a sanctum. Uh. One of its henchmen, I think, though. Close enough. <laughs> Vampire? A religious you, vampire? I was about to say, do you think churches have anything against vampires? Good question. Where you going, clown? I don't even know what just happened. <laughs> but back to the vampire. It's full of vampires. <laughs> oh. That, like. I forgot what's going on. Wait! That's the principal that Rimuru met when he was teaching school. That's also from his world. The clown or the guy sitting down? That's him. That's the principal. Hmm. Yuki. Wait, I'm confused. Wait, I thought they were working for. Oh, they work under Clay, man. Or they all were, I mean, they all work under this guy. Seems like, yeah. This girl. You know, I was reading the comments to this episode, right? Uh huh. Vision? Yeah. Right. And they were they basically said this is a clusterfuck of a meeting and it kind of is there's a lot of characters that I have to memorize names and faces Oh, he's oh. see Lord. what I see what I mean there's so many characters Oh really I like his design though he looks like he can handle himself yeah he does. Oh, so there was like a voting system for demon lords. Okay. Yeah. I thought it was just whoever the baddest was. Mm. 
first. You're right. I mean, they're right, right? Well, I still don't know if these people are villains or not. It's kind of weird. I assume they look like villains. But he's the principal. I mean, he's from Rimuru's world. He's from Japan. So. Exactly, which means he comes from another universe which he can use his own powers like Rimuru can against these guys or to his own advantage. Oh. Oh, that's it. This concludes our meeting. Like, oh, okay. <laughs> Such an interesting. I don't know guy. why, but I don't like that guy. Something about me just does not trust him. That's because most villains have the thin line eyes. <laughs> Yeah. But it was like in the last episode how he was about to literally obliterate the whole land just, just for his daughter. I'm like, hmm. It's really funny because Fuse is there and I bet he's like, I shouldn't be near these people. <laughs> <laughs> Veldora? <laughs> the Veldora. <laughs> oh, I love this. <laughs> They're just like in awe. <laughs> or maybe they just intimidated. That guy was definitely intimidated. He can't handle it. <laughs> Please behave yourself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're not getting rid of him. <laughs> well, he doesn't like that, right? I mean, Veldora was always just like destroy our worlds kind of thing. <laughs> you're probably gonna bring up like he destroyed my 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 nation or something like that. You know what I mean? I don't like this guy. You don't like any people. I don't like that guy in particular. Oh, he she oh he explained that he's been reincarnated. Okay. To them as well. That's interesting. You know what? I appreciate how brief this is because most animes will be like, well, and they go back to a flashback and just drag it out for an episode. Basically, I'm not. I'm not gonna mess with this group. <laughs> That's what he's trying to say. Well, his daughter kind of works here. Yeah, but like the, just the sheer firepower and just the names that they have behind Rimuru's group. It's true. Also, didn't the Dwarf Kingdom have some type of hostile, hostile hostility to Rimuru like way back? Well, it was a test thing. Okay, okay. <laughs> ah. Okay. And what does that mean for <laughs> the legacy of my family? <laughs> it's true. It is true. Alright, all right, everyone, everyone watching this video, I like him now. <laughs> <laughs> he won't be over. Friendship, damn it. <laughs> Always friendship. I do appreciate that they didn't brush over that. Like, there's some serious ramification, for, you know, annihilating a nation. <laughs> Just the army, not the nation. Uh, if anything, it's just a reminder of how far Rimuru has come from. Right? Yeah.
They just put the meeting on pause. <laughs> I guess so. Goose, are you doing okay? <laughs> yeah, this happened. Yeah. Like her design, but sucks that she's a bad guy, or at least the antagonist in all of this. I don't think she's a bad guy. I think she's just doing her job. Just mis misguided. That move's scary. Jeez. They did a second time. I was like, wow. Interesting. Unlike all other isekais, like they're aware of this, but it's like it's hush hush kind of thing, you know? Yeah. Well, typically in other isekais, it's a god's doing of some kind, not a not a super strong individual. This is true, yeah. Yeah. Oh no. Of <laughs> course, Diablo. <laughs> let me let me go handle her. <laughs> I smell attack team. Oh. <laughs> oh. What do you think is stronger? Okay, never mind. <laughs> well, to be fair, I mean, uh, Rimuru basically lost her. Hinata and she beat all three of these people. At least one of them, I think. Yeah. Two. Two. No, I, I think they only fought. Did, did she Rimuru. fight Shion? No. Okay, so two people she fought. <laughs> hey! <laughs> it's the, the other demon lord. Or, or fairy queen. It's been a while. Ex fairy, ex fairy queen, demon lord. Doomed, I say. <laughs> <laughs> Not really. I'm just gonna leave it. You. Wow, we still haven't gotten. Well, we got part part of the meeting. I think that was all the meeting. Was that all of it? No, they just started getting. Well, they 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 discussed. Uh, about Hinata and the whole that part, yeah, but they didn't really get into like, hey, here's what you need to do, hey, you need to do this and that, you know what I'm talking about? Like, actual planning in the meeting. Yes. Because they still gotta go back to their uh, respective nations and, you know, lay down the law and whatever rules. Oh, yeah, they do, huh? <laughs> but, uh... Doom the fall. That's what was just said. Is that over dramatic, or is that just like, is there a nation on its way? Uh, well, she so. is uh, an active demon lord, so I assume she's here to inform Rimuru of the meeting that's coming up. Yes. So. So. I'm just trying to gather all this information. There's a lot of stuff that actually happens. So let's see what happened. Uh, all the nations found out about Fedora. They're all intimidated. Uh, by his awesomeness. <laughs> Quite funny. Uh, let's see. Obviously, the two uh, the two kings, or the two leaders of their nation, they had a discussion Elves about Fedora. And yeah, and they basically agreed, like, hey, yeah, you know what? He's on our side. We'll, we'll spread the word. Wait, and Rimuru's like, I don't need you guys. I was going to do it myself anyway. That's what I like. I like Rimuru. Like, Rimuru has really changed from, like, a hesitant person from, like, the first couple episodes to, like, like now how I said it earlier, like, she's... She's like a king. She knows what she wants, how to do it, and taking control. Well, I mean, after that, you know, everyone died, and or not everyone, but a lot of people died, and they, you got to make a discussion, a discussion, a decision to kill humans to trans, you know, become human. Yeah, because it's a good thing you bought that. They all came back to life. Like, yeah, no one has any right to say remove anything. Like, she could literally say, "I brought you back to life, bro. Don't you talk back to me." <laughs> that kind of thing. But right? but she also did it the 
the first time ever to bring them back without like penalties. Because remember, true. The, it was the force field keeping the souls in. Or this is true. It was a very special situation, but it worked out in the end. But now, what is the next plan of action? You think they're gonna like uh, defend a nation? You think I still they I still think, gotta discuss uh Hinata what they're gonna do with her, or at least find a way to convince her, hey, we're not the bad I, guys here. I think they're gonna split up the teams. Split mm -hmm. up into teams to tackle different things. Yeah, I like that. I like it, I'm with it. But uh and I I, I assume at some point Rimu is gonna be talking about the demon meeting, and I assume it's gonna be at a very particular place and he's gonna end up going. Yep, because if I remember correctly, uh, it was like a meeting and it had to be seven votes to become a demon lord. I don't know if she's actually going to meet the demon, other demon lords, or she's just going to outright be like, nope, I'm the leader. Come deal with me now. No, but, I don't think it's going to be like quite like that. Yeah, if anything, we learned that it seems like Clayman and all the henchmen under him work for... Um, like, I Whoever, don't this old president that the principal brought back. That was inside yeah, but he kind of looks like Raphael, but I don't think they're the same person. I have to double check that. So let me know in the comments if that's actually the same person or not. But it looks Raphael. like him, right? I don't know. Well, yeah, remember because he was like talking about Hinata, and he's like, someone ratted me out to Hinata, or is they lied to her. And then did Rimu mention Raphael? No, oh, not Raphael. No, Raffi? Raphael. Raphael is the thing that is inside him. Oh, my bad. Sorry. Sorry. I have the text wrong then. But yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't know. But anyway, whoever that guy is, okay. Correction. Yeah, and the principal. He was the principal of the school. Anyway, the meeting's still going on, I assume. Uh, Felmouth seems to doomed to fall, and I don't think it's going to fall. I hope not. I really hope not. But we'll see, won't we? Yeah, so I think that wraps it up. And like always, guys, we will see you in the next episode.